Chapter 5 Formulas in MS Excel 2016 This chapter covers List Test Formula List Numeric Formula List Operators in MS Excel Write Simple Formulas List Operator Precedents Copy Formulas List Statistical Functions in MS Excel Sort Out Data Print a Worksheet Introduction you have used various formulas in mathematics. In MS Excel, formulas are written in a different manner. A formula in MS Excel begins with an is equal to sign and can be a maximum of 8192 characters in length. The data in a formula may contain any of the following values, numeric or string, cell address, a1, B4, etc. Functions, sum, average, max, min, etc. Operators, plus, minus, asterisk, question mark, greater than, lesser than, etc. Parenthesis. Facts to learn. The process of joining text values in a sequence within a formula is known as concatenation. Text formula. To make a simple text value, Enclose it in double quotes. For instance, equal to Microsoft in double quotes. The character ampersand is used to join text values to one another. For instance, equal to Microsoft in double quotes, ampersand, Excel in double quotes. The output of this formula would be Microsoft Excel in single quote. Numeric Formula Numeric formulas use operators that are applied to perform some type of calculations or comparisons. Operators in MS Excel Some of the important operators in MS Excel are arithmetic, relational and logical. Arithmetic operators Arithmetic operators are applied to the type of calculations with numeric values. They cannot be applied with strings. Relational operators Relational operators are applied to compare two values. They form relational expressions. These operators always produce a single value as output, true or false. Arithmetic operators in MS Excel Operator, function, usage, plus addition, equal to 7 plus 14 minus subtraction equal to 15 minus 8 asterisk multiplication equal to 5 multiplied by 12 slash division equal to 125 divided by 25 exponentiation equal to 6 3 percent equal to 70 percent relational operators in ms excel operator meaning usage Equal to A3 equal to B4. Not equal to C2 is not equal to D2. Greater than B6 is greater than 60. Less than C8 is less than 100. Greater than or equal to A5 is greater than or equal to B6. Less than or equal. E7 is less than or equal to 7. Logical operators in MS Excel NOT and OR Logical operators Logical operators are applied to compare two or more relational expressions. These operators also always produce single value as output, true or false. To write simple formulas, Let's learn simple formulas using the arithmetic operators that we just studied. There should be some arithmetic operator to operate on date or numbers. The data may be a cell address also. Look at some valid formulas in MS Excel. Equal to 20 plus 35 multiplied by 5. Equal to A1 plus B2. Equal to C5 multiplied by 15. Always remember, each formula should start with an equal to sign. Ensure that there should be no space before the equal to sign. Error surfaces 
you may get errors while doing calculations. Some common errors that surface with their reasons are 4 times hash, the column is not wide enough to display the number, hash value exclamation, the formula contains an invalid operation, hash div slash zero exclamation, division by zero is said an invalid operation, hash n slash a, data is not available, operator precedence. In numeric formula, the output of the formula is calculated on the basis of the order of precedence of the mathematical operations. Order of precedence of operators 1. Parenthesis 2. Exponent 3. Multiplication, division 4. Addition, subtraction Examples 5 plus 4 multiplied by 3 is equal to 17. 6 plus 6 divided by 2 is equal to 9. 5 multiplied by 2 minus 16 divided by 2 is equal to 2. 5 plus 6 in parenthesis multiplied by 5 plus 6 in parenthesis is equal to 121. 5 plus 7 in parenthesis divided by 2 is equal to 6. 8 exponent 2 plus 3 minus 7 is equal to 60. Facts to learn. When two operators such as plus, minus share the same ranking, the formula is always calculated from left to right. To copy formula. While writing formulas on fruits.xlsx, you write the formula in every row. But imagine if there was a long list of 50 items. Excel provides you the formula copying facility to assist you out. You require to type the formula only once and then you can drag it to other cells as you did with autofill. To copy a formula, follow the steps given below. Step 1. Type the formula in the first cell and press enter key. Step 2. Bring the mouse pointer to the corner of the formula cell. To the cell pointer handle and the mouse pointer will change the shape to a simple plus sign. This is known as the fill handle. Step 3. Click and drag the fill handle with left button till the end of the list. As you drag, you will see a dotted line appearing around the range of cells. Facts to learn. If you change the value in any of the cells whose address you have used in formula, the output in the corresponding cell changes out of statistical functions in MS Excel. In MS Excel, there are several predefined formulas that do particular calculations such as SUM in parenthesis calculates the total of a given set of values. AVERAGE parenthesis calculates the average of a given set of values. Max, parenthesis, calculates the maximum value from a given set of values. Min, parenthesis, calculates the minimum value from a given set of values. For instance, let's take the sum, parenthesis, function. To add, follow the steps given below. Step 1. Select an empty cell where some of the numbers will hold. For instance, F7. Step 2. Click Formulas tab on the ribbon. Step 3. Click the Insert function in Function Library group. The Insert function dialog box comes up. Step 4. Select Sum function and click the OK button. A new dialog box comes up. Step 5. Write the arguments in number fields, that is the range of cells, to get their sum. Here it is C7 to E7. Step 6. Click the OK button. The outcome appears in the desired cell. You may use other functions as well in the same manner. To sort out data. Arranging a given set of data according to a specific order, ascending or descending, is known as sorting. To sort data, follow the steps given below. Step 1. Select the cells with the data to sort. Step 2. Click the Data tab on the ribbon. Step 3. Click Sort in Sort and Filter group. Step 4. Choose the options you want.
For instance, total marks in sort by, values in sort on, largest to smallest in order. Step 5. Click the OK button. To print a worksheet. You may print a part or whole of the worksheet and obtain a hard copy of your data. To print a part of the worksheet, follow the steps given below. Step 1. Choose the data on the worksheet that needs to be printed. Step 2. Click the File button, then select Print option. The Print dialog box comes up. Step 3. Now, click on Selection in the Print What option. You may also increase the value of number of copies if you desire more than one copy. Step 4. Click OK button to obtain your printed sheet. Summary MS Excel is used to perform a lot of calculations with the help of functions and formulas. Arithmetic, relational and logical operators are fundamental kinds of operators. There should be some arithmetic operator to operate on data or numbers. Each formula in Excel should start with an equal to sign. Formulas may be copied by typing the formula only once and then dragging the fill handle. Arranging a set of data in ascending or descending order is known as sorting.